live from Studio 122 in sunny Miami, Florida. It's Talking at Night with Nick Rose. Give it up for the Studio 122 band. Good evening, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Talking at Night with Nick Rose. Today we got a very special guest, a critically acclaimed actor who has played a span of roles. He's appeared on such films as 1978's independent dark comedy, Lifesaver, and 1982's psychological thriller, Top of the Morning. It wasn't until his third film where he won the Hearts of America and a Wookiee Award for his role as Baby in the foreign film Passion de la Fruta. He was nominated for another Wookiee Award, ladies and gentlemen for his interpretation of Frankenstein's monster in the great film, Happy Birthday. He is here tonight to promote his new film as writer and director for Dirt, set to come out this summer. Some say he's like Scorsese, others compare him to Spielberg. I find him more akin to Stanley Kubrick. Freddie, nice to see you. So, I've already said enough about you. It's time to hear from the man himself. Tell me a little bit more of how he became an actor. I always saw myself as a master of disguise um, growing up. You know, I would go to certain fast food restaurants and steal the uniforms. I would go to, you know, big stores and actually try to work there and see if they actually believed me. Um, one time, you know, I actually got onto a, a phone call place, right? And I acted like I, I was a British dude. You know, I don't know if that's, I'm allowed to say that, but um, I was acting like, like a British fine. dude. and um. And everyone thought I was I was from Britain, and and everyone just, just started saying stuff to me like, "Hey, what's up, chap? Hey, how's it going? Hey, how's the Beatles?" You was know? it the Liverpool accent, the Sheffield accent? What take did you use? I don't know. I just watched Harry Potter a lot until I got it. Not quite sure what city that is. Harry Potter. Yeah, yeah, but I don't know what accent they're particularly portraying. It's a it's a fake movie. 